Hey you, Gryffindor. Imelda Rays? Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. I don't know what people have said, but I certainly wasn't showing off. Tell that to the rest of the school. But it doesn't matter. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Gryffindor. Can you tell me more about these courses? St stalling, fifth year. <laughs> Fine, I'll humour you. This course demands focus. Requires you to anticipate speed and height before every turn. The others test stamina. Three courses in all, built ages ago by former students. Since Black cancelled Quidditch, it was these courses or nothing. I made them popular again. Got the whole school hungry to compete. So, let's see what you've got, fifth year. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. Missed one. Ah, success! Brilliant. getting used to. Ah. Glad to see I'm still the reigning champion. But what say you? Want to try again? Ready when you are.
Glad to see I'm still the reigning champion. But what say you? Want to try again? Ready when you are. This is rather fun! You won. <sighs> Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Uh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Challenge accepted, then. Perhaps you have what it takes after all. We shall see. But don't get your hopes up. The next course near Irondale offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium, where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Alby Weeks. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. Impressive flying for a red.
I've always said that travel opens the mind. What do we have here? A demi guys. Alohomora. Sir, we've not took a thing. Hand them back. There's nothing to give, sir. It was only the one. Uh, that's all of them, sir. Honestly, I swear. How many times are you pair going to keep pilfering my shop? I swear it was just those ones, sir. Sorry, sir. We'd never take more than those. I tell you this, they'll not appreciate your antics in Azkaban. Wait till I see your mother. That was a bit hot. Revelio. What do we have here? A demi guys.
Brilliant. Revelio. Hello. Do you have anything for sale? That I do. But, uh, what's a student like yourself doing out here? Got yourself lost, did you? Just exploring the countryside a bit. Hi. <laughs> nice to break the routine now and then. Bit of a wanderer myself, in fact. The name's Leopold Babcock, and I am indeed here to sell. <laughs> now. For someone like yourself who is also prone to wander, I cannot understate the importance of keeping some Wiganweld potion on hand. I wouldn't dare set foot in a place like the Forbidden Forest without a steady supply. What do you say, my young friend? A measure of safety for the path ahead? Something to consider. Thank you for your help, Mr. Babcock. Aye, let me know if you see something you like. What do you have for sale? See if there's something you need. I shall hope to do business with you again. That's been a pleasure. See if there's something you need. That's been a pleasure. Revelio. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise.
handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Revelio. Hello there. Nice to see you. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. <sighs> He's a friend. It seemed as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now? We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him, about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards, even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. Friendship between wizards and goblins is rare enough, but between those two, they each want something the other has. I can guarantee it. That said, I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. You seemed unfazed by Rookwood and Harlow the other day. They don't scare you. They're bullies. Plain and simple. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly won't tolerate them going after my friends. Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. Thank you, Serona. If you find Lord Gog, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. Hello, Miss Willardsey. Well, what happened? Did you find them? They led me into the forest and revealed a treasure. Oh, how lovely! I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. Oh, perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see. Should I dare? Rebellion. You too, I'll meet. Pengister Woodcroft certainly knew how to plan a city. Have you ever been a vampire worth knowing? <laughs> to ask about never had a chance in the first place. <laughs> oh, will there ever be another wizard?
Welcome to the Og's Head. Any empty seat is yours. What do we have here? Hello, Lord Gok. Serona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am, and I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Serona trusts me, and she said she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need and meet me near the witch's tomb. Revelio!